this absolutely stunning snake is the Waggler's Pit Viper, also known as the Temple Viper. These guys are found quite widespread throughout many areas of Southeast Asia, including Thailand, Vietnam, and multiple areas in Malaysia and Indonesia. Now, this one up here is a female Waggler's Pit Viper, and they display a very, very high level of sexual dimorphism. And this one is the male Waggler's Pit Viper. It is quite a bit smaller than the female, which can reach up to over one meter long, but these guys max out at around 70-75 centimeters. They are also very bright green instead of having a more black, yellow, orange coloration, and this is also very similar to what the juveniles look like. Here you can see quite well the distinction between the female and the male of the species. There is definitely a noticeable difference. Now this does make it quite easy to tell which sex the snake is, which famously is rather difficult to do in reptiles because in general, they don't have a very high level of sexual dimorphism. The Waggler's Pit Viper is described as being relatively sluggish and just kind of hangs out. They are nocturnal, and while they do strike very fast, they mostly spend their time just hanging out. They will eat pretty much anything that they can get, including reptiles, birds, and mammals. And like all pit vipers, they are quite venomous, and their venom does contain four distinct proteins that thus far have only been found in this species and then is named after them, Waglerin, one through four, one for each protein. Now, despite it being rather toxic, bites from these guys are rare since they're very non-confrontational and described as being not aggressive, kind of at all. Now, that being said, obviously, if you're in an area where these snakes are found, don't go around messing with them, since they are still dangerous, venomous animals. They are just unlikely to bite unless being provoked or bothered or accidentally stepped on.